What is up guys, it's Mike Tamimo here and welcome to my YouTube channel and most of all, welcome to my Gothic 3 playthrough, the playthrough of the Hushishin aka Baliar and this is episode 12 part 3 where we will continue where we left off in part 2 of Morasul. So let's wait a bit for the loading screen now, I have to it say in advance, it's once again one nearly uh, it's currently 12.30, um, no, 12.50 even, so almost 1am in the morning, so even though it's weekend, you know, I'm gonna try to keep my voice as low as possible, but you guys, you know, pretty sure you guys will still understand me quite loud and clear, but uh, let's get Alma and Yasmin to Morasul. I'll take you out of here. I'll take you out of here. Good. I didn't didn't quick say did I? Nope. -lo 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 -lo. Better you than me! I hate those beasts. You and me both, lady. Madam. Whatever. Now these hanging plants makes me a bit happy. Provided that I don't have to waste them manually. Because uh, I can certainly use all the potions I can get. Especially with the Temple of Morasu.
miserable beast. I had a miserable beast near to kill me. I don't have cure. Really. Oh, that's suckish. I don't have cure disease. Maybe the merchant has one. Sounds so wrong. Are these guys blind? Give him what for? Give him what for? What a bunch of useless dicks in those NPCs. Yeah, go Bloodfly, give him what for, man. Woo! -hoo. They're all like, you know, we can help you. But we won't. Kick his ass, Yasmin. Miserable beast. Both. Let me make sure that all the critters surrounding this oasis are dead before I'm gonna check the merchant for a cure disease.
miserable beast. Take that, rotten beast! I like this uh, dual wielding sword. I kill more with it than any other blade because of the uh, swing in the swing swing. I like to call it spin to win. You can see we're talking right now. Somebody is gonna pay for this. Shh. You got cure disease? You don't. Why? Why the fucking noob? And that's how it's gonna be. And I had seven of those stone tablets. God damn it! Apparently not. Everybody needs to pay tribute. Fuck the tributes. And use the gold to obtain Belial's wrath, not to keep it away. Yeah, I'm not so sure about this. And let's go, ladies. I know there was a. I know that Yusuf was near Morasu, so I'm gonna first go there before I will actually. Ladies, come on! Stupid NPCs. It's not that hard. Jasmine is bugged. Great! Over here, woman! Beast. Yeah, I really need to get, take care of this disease, but uh, I've got no potion for it. But then at least I've been using some endurance potions, which is uh, quite rare. There it is. 
Come on, ladies, we're almost there. No, it isn't this one. This is where Newt was at. It's over there. Now I can be better save them for potions. Oh there. No, I'm not really in a state at the moment to uh, fight against a couple of ogres, so I'll take care of them later. Jackals. Beast. Now, do not kill Yusuf if the uh, paladin guy is near it, because he will. if you kill him, he will kill you afterwards. Unless you beat him too, of course, but uh, I still have to do his quest, so I cannot kill Yusuf right now. But I will do so once he's a bit out of sight when we go to the uh, injured crawler. Hey stranger, have you got water? Here, have a sip. Thanks man, that feels good. What are you doing out here? Are you a runaway slave? No chance of passing for anything else. You won't betray me, will you? There's bound to be something I can give you. But please let me go. What can you tell me? Everyone is after me. 
I stole the keys to the temple of Mora Sul and sold them to some influential people. But before I could sell the last one, I had to run for it. Who in Mora Sul bought the temple keys from you? I had four keys. The mercenary Kirk paid a lot of gold for one of the keys. I sold one to Ilya, and the third to the boss of the city, Gonzales. What do you know? That means you still have a temple key. Give it to me. All right. I just hope you'll let me live. I have a hunch what you're planning to do. You want to open the temple. Let me tell you, there's a curse on that temple. There are? Old Nazir warned me about it. He said a great disaster would befall us if the temple was opened. You said you had four temple keys. Yes, but I don't know how many of them there are. But if it's more than four, the rest still must be somewhere near the temple of Morasul. I see. Now I cannot kill him just yet, like I said, because of the paladin. This horrible desert is really getting to me now. What happened? As if the awful heat weren't enough. One has to deal with those stupid beasts as well. I had a campsite over to the north, and the sand crawlers came one night and almost killed me. And one of those things ended up eating all of my stuff, devouring it, you know? But I slugged that beast a good one before I ran for my life. That sand crawler should be badly injured. Oh well, I'll never go back there by myself. It's hell out there, let me tell you. What's a paladin doing in this land? I am here on a holy mission. The fire mages sent me on a quest for the fire chalices. Yes, and I found one too. That was no piece of cake, believe me. And now my chalice is in the belly of that sand crawler from hell. Happily roaming the desert. Let's go look for your injured sand crawler. I don't need to go looking for that horrid beast. I know exactly where it is. Follow me. It's payback time. Now before I do though, I have a man to kill. I've been ordered to kill you. Oh hell, take it easy friend. Please don't do that. I'm sure I can be useful to you. I accepted the mission to kill you and that's what I'm going to do now. You filthy swine. May your remains shrivel in the sands of the desert. I'll show you. Kick his ass. Let him have it. No gold? Too bad. What? Good thing I quick saved. Because I was like, you know, maybe if he's in my party, he wouldn't mind. But, uh, he does. <laughs> So I've, I have to get uh, the paladin a bit further out of the camp. Because Yusuf has to die. I'll tear you apart! Was hoping that he maybe uh, would carry a potion of disease or something.
But no, the only thing that he left in the middle of the desert is weed, and that's not smart. Smoking weed makes your mouth like the desert, and if you're in the desert with no water, you're gonna be fucked. And he was fucked. He died. The desert. Come on, ladies. We got some crawlers to kill. Another one of those beasts. Better you than me. There, so much for you, filthy beast. Just to crawl it in here. Got him. These damn beasts are everywhere. One filthy beast less. Spin to win. We look at this. This is my old campsite. Your injured sand crawler is finished. Good thing, too. That beast was possessed by Beliar himself. Believe me. So, what about your fire chalice? I am going to need your help again. Cut open that sand crawler and get the thing out of him. Then take the wretched chalice to the fire mages in Nordmar. I will keep looking around here. Maybe I'll find some more after all. Let's go, ladies. On to Morasul. Still a bit of a long journey, ladies, but we'll be there in no time. I could be there instantly, you know, but that would be useless because then they would stand here doing nothing.
just gonna take a bitch, you know, but uh it's gonna be useful. Alright, let's go ladies. That's quite a few. Two, four, six. No, thank you. It's a bit too risky. Especially if your stamina is drained like a bowels and you have no cure disease. Apparently I didn't hand me to. Shame. Show me your goods. You have care poison, but not care freaking disease. Useless merchants. I did away with the guards. Excellent, Father of Vigor. Naturally, you have earned a reward. Now, if you bring back my gold as well, you can be sure of my undying gratitude. Here are your 700 gold coins back. Thank you, Father of Prudence. Take this water and some of my gold as a token of my gratitude. My prayers will go with you on every scorched path that you walk, my friend. Yeah, your gratitude is boundless. Fortunately, it was also a bounty, so that's gonna pay me a bit decent. Now before I deliver one of these two girls, I will quick save, just to be sure. Show me your goods. Also no freaking cure disease. What a bunch of idiotic merchants. Alright, so let me quick save. Just to see what I get from giving Jasmine to him or versus what I get from giving Jasmine to Gomez or, or Gonzalez. I brought somebody for you. Lovely Jasmine! Mine at last! Thank you so much, son of gallantry. Take this gold. I will also vouch for you with Gonzalez. So no reputation? Not even city reputation.
Orknarok is at the excavation. Good. Now we can get down to business. What is it? Well, first we need a bit of gold. And I happen to know how we can get it. I have a magic ore blank. If we sell it, we will get a hefty sum of gold. What do you think? How much are you asking for the ore blank? Well, you should know that I borrowed gold from a couple of business partners. With the ore, it shouldn't be any problem paying off my three promissory notes. I get the blank, and you get your promissory notes. Hmm. A good deal for both of us. What do you say? I'll take a look into the business with your promissory notes. Good. Here is the ore blank. I would sell it myself, but... Well, if I show up just anywhere with it, I'll get a fraction of its value at most. I see. Now let's see what I get from delivering Yashmin to Gonzales. Should give either reputation of the city or with the Hashishin. About the gifts for Gonzales. Speak. What do you have to offer? I am bringing a beautiful dancer. Mm, indeed. A beauty. Good gift. She will find her place at the side of my master. I have a beautiful woman here for him. What an extremely fetching gift. Gonzales will enjoy himself. Right, so this one is worth. Thank you, kind sir. Belonging to the richest man in town is a huge step towards my goal. Mark my words. Someday I will be the wife of Gonzales. Well then, good hunting. What is beauty worth without freedom? Can you tell me that? You'd better go now. Let me get 200 strength. Would you teach me how to fight? Good. <clears throat> <clears throat> Good. I need two twenty in total. Yusuf the artifact thief is dead. You found him. Good work, master of the sharp eye. May this bring joy to your heart. Anyway, Gonzales will be pleased to hear this good news. Cafu's former guards are history. <laughs> good work. I knew you could do it. You also get a fat reward. Gonzales will be proud of us. I found Ramirez. Good. Where is he? He's dead. Mingal is bound to find that interesting. You'd better tell him yourself. So see to it that Nasib lets you in. Here is the promised reward. Teach me something about hunting. Carry on. Carry on like that. Good. <clears throat> Show me your goods. Come on, man. Get yourself some cured siege. You had better not disturb me. Show me your goods. All of them has antidote. I want Masil's promissory note. How much do you want for it? I won't take your gold. You need it with the others. And what do you want? Mm, nothing. At least not yet. I'll come back to that later.
It's all settled. The fat man is in business again. See? That wasn't so hard. And you'll get a reward, too. I should damn well think so. Here, take this. I suppose this is what you had in mind. I wish you success with the tasks that lie ahead of you, stranger. Show me your goods. I have come about Masil's promissory note. Just a moment. I need to see where I put it. Ah, yes. It's two, let's say three and a half. Two thousand gold coins. You're joking, right? Or you give me a piece of raw ore. You know about the ore? Hey, everybody here knows that Masil has raw ore. And now he sends you to repay his debt. So, you've heard my offer. Here's the raw ore. Excellent. And here's the promissory note. Give me Masil's promissory note. Mm. All right. Since you insist, I hope you know what you're doing. Don't let Masil get the better of you. Here's the promissory note. Show me your goods. I need 40,000 gold. I really need a better armor upgrade. You took advantage of me, son of betrayal, you lousy dog. You gave Yasmin away to Gonzalez. I will never forgive you for this. Come here! It's going to be a fight, men. Yeah. That's the way. That's the way. Here's some advice. Good. You made the right decision. Here, take this. You are now out of debt. Oh, thank you. Now I am finally free of my debts. Now, I am free to do business in the city again. Take this as a reward. And good luck with your own business, stranger. Don't let them fleece you. That happens all too easily in the city. Give me the fire mage's chalice. Gladly. Here it is. Got too much time on your hands? Now the moon blade is competing in the arena. I'm gonna avoid that for now unless absolutely necessary. But the problem with this one is that uh, in order to get the moon blade, I have to beat the entire arena. Um, and I want to do all the arenas, you know, in one particular episode. How many keys do I already have? One, two, and three. All champion is four, Gonzalez is five. It looks like I have to compete in the arena to get uh, the remaining 20 
points. Let me quickly go to, uh, no, our Dia, Redic, any will do. Oh, that's Braga. I don't think Braga has, uh, cure disease. Nice twitching. Stay alert. Show me your goods. There must be a merchant somewhere with uh, the required item. Show me your goods. Because the problem is, you know, Isla's artifact is inside Morasul's temple. Um, open the temple of Morasul, therefore I need to open the temple. The problem is that I've got three keys. Number four is with the, Orc of the, the Orcish commander and number five is with Gonzalez, which I need to pay about 10k gold for or something like that. But therefore, I need to get access to Gonzalez, so I do have to Show compete in the arena, sadly but true. Hey, you've got it, good man. I don't have the ingredients for that. Alright, anyways guys, I want to thank you guys for watching, if you like what you see, subscribe to my channel, hit the like button, and uh, you know, once again I have to break my own rule, which is uh, not competing in the arena. Now in Bakaresh, I had to do it only one match, but in this one I have to do the whole thing, which is a bit too bad, but uh, I've got no choice. Would you teach me how to fight? But that is all in the next part. Let me quickly train my strength a bit. 
or I wait till I beat the arena I can get Master Swordsman. I'm going to do that. Anyways guys, thank you guys for watching. If you like what you see, sub subscribe to my channel, hit the like button if you want to see a gothic series hardcore run. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Well, next part of this episode. And uh, if you want to see a different playthrough, whether it's the human orc mercenary or you want to see the rebels, you can find both on my channel. And uh, I hope you will enjoy any one of them. And I wish, I hope that I will see you guys in the next episode. Well, part episode part. It's principle the same, but. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.